morning. Ash Wednesday is the beginning of Lent, the 40 days of fasting and prayer and of spiritual discipline. It might seem funny, but actually Ash Wednesday starts with a reminder of our, our death, the fact that we're going to die. In a traditional Anglican service, the minister would put the ashes on your forehead with a, a sign of a little cross and say, quoting Genesis chapter 3, 18, from dust you came and dust you will return. You might think, why do we need more reminders of our death? After all, 2.4 million people have died so far worldwide. 193 people in Hong Kong have died because of COVID. It's what dominates our life and the news cycle every day. But Ash Wednesday, this reminder, is a different sort of reminder. It's not a reminder of, a, of the threat of death. It's a reminder that actually we will survive it. We live and we die, but we will uh, live again and to, to meet our maker. It's asking the question, are we ready for that meeting? You might know that Pastor Tim Keller has been battling pancreatic cancer. When he was first diagnosed, he says two words came to his mind, focus and sanctification. Focus, uh, focus uh, not on the earthly things, but to live his life, the rest of his life uh, for God for, uh, and focus on the spiritual things. And he says he doesn't like the phrase, he's battling cancer. Because although he is battling cancer, that's not the fight that he's battling. The fight, he says, is against his sins. Because without his sins, he says he would be fine. You know, if he didn't have his sins, he would be resting in Christ. That, that the, the hope of the resurrection would be so real for him that he wouldn't worry. He would be fine, he says. No, he says he's, he's not battling cancer. He's fighting sin, sin every day. He wants to be ready to meet his maker. So he says he put his prayer life on steroids. He put his spiritual life on steroids. He put his focus on steroids, asking the question, well, how much time do I actually have? One year or two years? maybe even five years, then how will I spend that time, the rest of my life? Church, that's what Ash Wednesday is all about. We're all going to die. But at this time, in this season, let's battle our sins. Let's put our spiritual life, uh, let's put our prayer life on steroids. Let's focus on God. Let's get focused and really reflect deeply. How will we spend the little amount of time that we have here on earth? Let's get ready to meet our maker. For dust we came, and to dust we will return.